Hindi ko alam. Bagay sa akin yung topic ano na yun. Ano yung topic ni Doka? Alam ko, pag-usapan natin. Ito daw ang topic natin. Bagay na bagay sa mga mahilig sa gulay. A concise guide to vegetarianism. I love it. Para sa inyo ito, Monica. Oo nga eh. This segment, this topic is mga picture ng gulay. Dedicated for you. Meant to be. Yes. Oh, yan. Teka, welcome muna natin si Dr. Jessica. Jessica De Leon, Family Medicine Integrative Medicine. Yun nga, ang ating topic ay Concise Guide to Vegetarianism. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome po sa bahay ni Kuya. Doc, ano ba ang pagiging isang vegetarian? Ah, ano ba yan? Oh. yun ang pagkain ng lahat ng mga bagay na walang mukha. Huh? Mm. <laughs> oh, walang, huh? walang, so you don't walang eat mata, anything without a... Uh, anything with a face. Okay. Oh, walang mata, so, walang fish bibi. Okay. So, fish, mm. ano rin? Bawal din. Oh, oh. Ba? Para all gulay. Hindi, all gulay. All gulay. Okay. And then, tapos pagkaganyan, di ba bawal din yung mga milk, yung mga dairy oh, products? Maraming, may dalawang klase mainly, mm. no? Two kinds. Merong lacto-ovo vegetarian, meaning kumakain pa rin ng, ng itlog, tsaka mm. konting gatas, mm -hmm. tsaka cheese. Mm. Tapos yung mga talagang vegan, yun yung talagang purely vegetables, walang dairy. What, what about yung ibang kumakain? Di ba yung mga pesco shellfish, may mga ano mo natin sila? May mga pesco-vegetarian ah. kumakain pa rin ng fish. Pero okay. strictly speaking, ano, yung Veggies. dalawa, yung lacto-ovo at saka yung vegan. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sa Pilipinas, mas madali maging lacto-ovo vegetarian kasi karamihan ng mga products natin, mga tinapay, mga bibingka, ganyan, mm. meron. Oh. <laughs> meron oh, okay. Di ba normally sila yung mga magaganda yung skin, di ba? Tsaka yung scent. I remember may naging isang pasyente ako before, hinahabol siya ng butterflies eh. Oo. Oh, oh. Pag ah, nasa garden, scent. yes. Kasi, di ba, ang scent natin actually comes from the food that we take in. Exactly. Okay. So, mm -hmm. ano po yung na-encounter niyo so far na naging downside naman po? I mean, di ba, syempre marami rin po kasi um, vitamins and minerals that we get mm. from the meat no, po, yes. na hindi nila mm. nakakain. Mm. Uh, the downside is that you just have to be careful about the va variety of food. Mm -hmm. Kasi, syempre, may mga amino acids na hindi nakukuha sa ibang, yung pro, klase ng protein na hindi nakukuha sa mga gulay. So, kailangan iba-ibang gulay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like for example, uh -oh. the corn, wala siyang tryptophan. Uh Oo. -oh. Mm -hmm. So, kailangan, kumain ka lang, iba-ibang klase. Mm -hmm. Pinakamagandang clue dito, para hindi mo natigdan yung food exchange list. Oh, ito mm -hmm. ba, may tryptophan, ito ba, may lysine, arginine, yeah. napaka-technical. Basta maraming iba-iba at saka maraming kulay. Ay, yung, oh, Colors. Yes. Sabi nyo nga po, iba't ibang klase Masarap. yung vegetarianism natin, ah. di ba? How would you, uh, kunyari, for example, recommend one uh, who would go into that kind of lifestyle? Like, for example, uh -huh. sa akin, normal eating, tapos I would like to go into vegetarianism. Yeah, so, 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 paano yun? So, paano Yun, what do you recommend as a start? Ah, sa mga beginners, you know. Ah, you want to go to how, no? Mm. Pa, hindi ayaw pa naman pa ng bakit tayo mag oh, oh, okay. yeah. so, mo na bakit. bakit. Yes. Yung, bakit. Marami mga arguments. Actually, meron tayong mga numbers niyan eh. One is the, of course, the uh, hunger argument. Okay. Oh, marami kasing nagugutom. Tapos pag tinignan mo yung dami ng patatas na pwede mong i-produce with the same amount of resources, napakarami compared sa same amount of resources. Ngayari, kamote. No? Mara for the same amount of resources, so, ang dami mo nang mapaproduce na kamote kumpara sa uh, resources na gagamitin mo to produce meat. Mm -hmm. okay. okay? So, mas marami kang mapapakain with, directly with vegetables uh -huh. than with meat. Kasi magastos mag-produce ng meat. Just imagine, you have to put up a slaughterhouse, put up, mm -hmm. ano yung iba, in-aircon pa yung mga yeah, oh, baboy, oh. mga baka, ganyan, di ba? It's very expensive. Bibigyan mo pa ng antibiotic. Kasi nagkakasakit lagi. Mm -hmm. Oo, oh, kasi dikit-dikit sila eh. They're produced in factory farms. They're all mixed up together. Para siyang, kumbaga, evacuation camp. Mm -hmm. okay. So, wala silang life. Okay. They don't have a life. Wala silang family life, wala silang social life, wala silang sex life. Basta wala silang buhay kasi nandun lang sila lahat in one place. Lagi sila may sakit. Mm -hmm. So it's expensive to produce meat. Yan, pounds of potatoes na kailangan. For an acre, 20,000. Kumpara sa pounds of beef, 165 lang mm -hmm. produce mo in an acre of land. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yun. Tapos, this is the hunger argument. The other is the environmental argument. Yung fossil fuels na na na, 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 na produce mo from meat ay mas mataas kaysa sa fu fossil fuels na na, na, na 50 times more fossil fuels sa meat centered diet compared sa sa fossil fuels na ginagamit mo to produce vegetables, vegetables. Mas wala 50 mm -hmm. times more tapos for every quarter pound of hamburger 
Sorry ah. Mm -mm. Alam mo ba kung gaano karaming tropical rainforest yung masisira natin? Mm. 55 square feet. Wow. Samantalang, pag nag, nag, tanim ka ng mga gulay, wala kang masisira ang tropical rainforest. Pwede mo pang intercommerce sa mga ano, mag Pwede mo pang ilagay, mga contribute ka pa sa, sa oxygen mm -hmm. ng, ng paligid natin. Mm. Sa limot pala, no? Sa limot. <laughs> That's only the two arguments na marami pa iba, the cancer argument. Yeah. Oh, oh. So, it makes sense talagang cancer. ano, marami na talagang factors pa lang dapat i-consider. cholesterol. Mas marami cholesterol. Yeah. Kasi syempre, mas madali ka sumexy. Yung tubig na ginagamit natin, yung tubig na ginagamit natin, produce a pound of wheat, wheat or bigas, 25 gallons lang. Mm -hmm. To produce a pound of meat, it's 2,500 gallons. Oh. Ang taas, di ba? 2,500 divided by 25. Ang laka ng difference. That's yeah. math. <laughs> oh, sorry, ah. Tapos, susunod, marami pa ibang arguments, no? Mm. So, sinabi natin, cholesterol, cancer, pesticide. Alam niyo ba na sa breast milk ng mga, ng mga kumakain ng maraming meat? Kasi gusto natin talaga nagbe-breastfeed, di ba? Yes. Ako, ako, hanggang three and a half years yung anak ko, nagbe-breastfeed siya, bend of machine oh. na nga ako, akin siya dito, <laughs> tawag na, mas oh, baba siya, di ba? Pero pag kumakain ng kanang karne, yung quality ng breast milk po, of course, na dyan lahat ng mga antibodies. Oh. Pero, may pesticide residue, 35 times higher than in non-meat eating mothers. Uh -huh. Non-meat eating mothers. Mm -hmm. And daming pesticide kasi, mm -hmm. sa mga karne, hormones, pesticides, mm -hmm. antibiotic, antibiotic argument pa. <laughs> Since we're giving them antibiotics all the time, while even if you don't take antibiotics, you're exposed to antibiotics. Mm -hmm. So, kung may antibiotic resistance, mm -hmm. hindi ka na mag magre-respond sa antibiotic kasi ang dami mo nang nakain through the food. Oh, yes. Yung mga manok nga lang ngayon, mga GMO yeah. eh. Yeah. Natin yeah. Oh, iba pa yan. Iba pa yung GMO na sabi ni Dr. Nelia Maramba, my favorite pharma teacher, <laughs> and toxicologist, Then, sabi niya na hindi mo nakikita yung epekto ng GMOs ngayon. Mm -hmm. But in the next generation, you'll see the effect. Kasi, oo. Pero ibang usapan pa yun, no? Okay. Tapos, what mm -hmm. other argument? Antibiotic argument? The ethical argument. Mm -hmm. Kasi, feelings. alam niyo ba na may feelings ang mga baboy, Ay, baka, yes. manok? Yes. yes. Oo. Kasi, yung ano nga namin, yung the first time, I, nap napadayo ako sa Laloma. Sorry, ah. Hindi ko sinisiraan. Pero, dyan, ah. Ha? Mga litsyon. So, Water. nagulat ako kasi di sinalaksak nila yung baboy. Mm -hmm. Hindi pa namatay. Umiiyak pa siya. Umiiyak, no, umiiyak pa siya. Yeah. Tapos pinabol pa nila. That's just one. Itignan e, nyo pa yung lobster. mga slot, lo, slaughterhouses, Ayaw, oh, pistols. Yun. Yun. Alam mo yun, di, talagang malungkot sila. So, if you eat, uh, you know, you products ng, ng mourning and grieving, you're also eating their Um, unhealthy, grieving, sad energy. Mm. Oh, tsaka, nakakaawa talaga sila. Kala natin yes. wala silang feelings. May feelings yeah. sila. Mm -mm -mm. So, mas mabuti na yung gulay, hindi sila magre-reklamo, di ba? Kung may mm. kanilang lechugas, okay lang sa kanila. Mm. <laughs> Mga talbos ng kamote, dahong sili, alubate, okra. Mm. Yes. Walang problema. Walang problem. Masaya sila pag kinain natin. Meron sila, akong, mm -mm, sila. ano, Doc, meron nang kilalang Hollywood actress na si uh, Gwyneth Paltrow, tsaka mm. si uh, Alicia Sil Silverstone, na talagang Uh, mga vegetarian sila, no? Ito si Alicia Silverstone, sumulat pa nga siya ng book. Mas sinabi niya nang simula na naging vegetarian siya, gumanda yung tubo ng buhok niya, yung tubo ng nails niya, at saka yun nga yung scent, yung sinasabi yes. ni Doc. Yes. So yun yung mga isa talaga. sa mga... Kahit yung poops, yeah. mamaw. Oh, yes. Isa sa mga yeah. benefits ng pagiging vegetarian. Saka maganda, ayan, yeah, yung sa poops, gumaganda po yung ano, uh, daily bowel movement. Of course, Very kasi regular. marami ng fiber. And eh. in that case, mas, baka mas bababa po yung risk of uh, having colon cancer. Siyempre, diba? that's the cancer argument. Yes. Mas marami talaga yung... Fiber. Mm -hmm. yes. Tapos, siyempre, kung maraming fiber din, mas na-absorb yung mga Toxic. toxins yes. na pinakain mm -hmm. mo, lumalabas talaga sa poop. Mm -hmm. Ito, sir, yung parang nagwawalis ng intestine nagwawalis. natin. Mm -hmm. While I no doubt na it's a healthy, no? Um, Pinag-aralan kasi din namin sa nutrition, there's what you call yung blood typing. Not, ah, not blood all, type yeah, Not all blood types daw can be can, can uh, be compatible with a full vegetarian diet. There are some people who are allergic to wheat, some people who are allergic to protein, some people who can be allergic to uh, green leafy vegetables also. So isn't it true also that... There are many kinds of vegetables. No, I'm so saying, just isn't it true that some people have more protein needs than other people? I work out, so 
I have more protein needs. <laughs> no, for example, because I'm, I'm a nutritionist by profession also. Uh -huh. And I've worked with athletes who've tried green leafy vegetables. Ganda ng ano nila. Ah, ng hair, yeah. ganda ng face, ganda ng overall health. But when they, it came time to perform against those who were consuming uh, meat, not, yeah. not, not meat, ah, but products that could have uh, meat content like whey or protein, uh -huh. They per, they outperform those who were consuming. Yeah, that's why. Lang. Yeah, that's why I I per, personally prefer because I work out. I'm mm. lacto ovo. Mm, okay. So I take some. Yeah. And ano yung varieties lacto ovo is? Lacto ovo is you take some milk and yeah. eggs and yeah. dairies. Yeah. Yeah. And then the that's why I, I actually zero yeah. Zero that's zero. The, 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 like when I was trying to build up build a little more muscle, uh -huh. I, uh, I had to take some whey. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Question. Kailangan ba pagka maging vegan ka, kailangan organic din yung mga... Yan. Yan. Yung mga ano Importante mo, kasi ayaw mo yeah, ng pesticide yeah, eh. So yes. kung kumakain ka ng hilaw na gulay, tapos ang daming pesticide, you're also Bio getting free din. pesticide. So kailangan organic yung bibili. Yeah, mm -hmm. organic. But there are um, okay. food items that are uh, organic by default. Mm -hmm. Kasi okay. hindi wala naman nagsispray ng malunggay, talbos ng kamote, mm -hmm. dahong sili, alugbate, aratelis. Yes. Alam mo mm -hmm. na, wala nagsispray na. Wala, Mga wala. locally endemic, mm -hmm. they're usually, um, by default, they're organic. Mm -hmm. But of course, our advocacy is for, pe for people to actually plant. Mm -hmm. Kahit sa frontier mo, pwede ka magtusok ng malunggay, yeah. alugbate. Oh, Alam ba, dali-dali lang na. Ako may oregano ako, mga ganon. Oh. And then, hinihingi kong regalo talaga pag nag-speaking engagement. Pwede bang imbis na plaque, gastos niya, binyan niya lang ako ng aratelis. Ganun. Ang sarap naman, doktora. Kaya meron aratelis. Pag bukas mo ng window mo, andun yung kakainin mo. Oo, may santo, di kayo nito. Ganun. Pero gusto ko rin i-emphasize na yung tungkol doon sa mga athletes, no? Yes. They're really triathletes like Dave Scott, who really perform. They're vegetarians. Six-time winner. Six-time winner ng triathlon. Iron man to. Ay, hindi na simple. Ano, bodybuilder. Ako, bodybuilder. Swimming, running, bike. And he's a six-time winner. And he's vegetarian. Pero pagka nag-ano ka? And yun si Tyrannosaurus Rex. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Ang pinakamalaking meat eater that ever lived. Pero, nasa na si Tyrannosaurus Rex? Wala na siya. Yeah, wala na. History. <laughs> That's history why, eh. Why the dinosaurs disappeared. <laughs> it was not because yeah. they were eating meat. Yeah, yeah. Yes. But we're saying, so in compared <laughs> to... That, that, you can't use that as an argument. You can't use, use that. You can't yeah, use that as an you argument. You like T-Rex. Dinosaur na siya. So, ang question ko, yeah, anyway. how young can you start being a vegetarian? Kasi we all know, in growing kids, you cannot just ano, feed them with vegetables kasi they also need protein to grow. Diba? You give them best meal. Paano yung go grow? Yeah, yeah. You give them best meal. Actually, in the food pyramid, the most important is the under which is water. Water talaga yung ilalim na pinakamarami, tubig eh. And then, of course, there's other ways to look at go grow and glow, di ba? Like, of course, breast milk is the best source of protein. So, you start them on breast milk. And then, and because, and then you can go on to the different kinds of vegetable uh, protein in vegetables. Like sprouts have a lot of protein. Mm -hmm. Alfalfa oh. sprouts, broccoli sprouts, lahat ng klaseng sprouts ibigay mo. Dahon dahon ko. Dahon dahon. Tapos yung mga yung mga oh. anak ko talaga nung umpisa, they we, we, because we juice every day, every mm -hmm. day we mm -hmm. have a shot of green juice in the morning, all of us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So when they're out of the country, they're out of town, they miss the green, green juice. juice. Mm -hmm. So we, you can put sprouts into the juices. And then, of course, they like munching on things mm -hmm. like munching on carrots. Of course, pero kung for protein, legumes. Lahat ng klaseng kulay ng lentils. Yellow That's beans, red protein. beans, green mm -hmm. beans. Of course, so ayaw mo ng beans. Sa sa kanila, carrots, oh. carrots. Oh. Singkamas, celery. Hindi ko nagali enjoy it, ha? Doc, meron ako yung last question. Meron ako yung last question, Doc. Pag ako, ba, let's say, for example, nagustuhan ko nga maging vegetarian, ano, ilang, ilang, kailan ko kaagad makikita yung result? Ilang days, ilang weeks? Ah, if you've been on meat for a long time, syempre, meron lag time. It will take about a few months to to get to that. Pero it's a process, eh. And you're not expect there's a transitioning, so you question, how do you do it? You do it gradually and with joy. Hindi pwede, kawawa naman ako, okay naman ako. Hindi pwede, gano'n. Tapos, 
Ako pala saya ka, wow! Sing ka mas, gano'n. Ako ano, hindi, hindi kasi ako masyado, kaya tahimik ako, hindi ako masyado yeah. mahilig sa gula. Oh, masyado na ako sa amin. Hindi talaga. Yes, <laughs> ayan o. Oh. Hindi kumakain so, ng gulay. Kumakain naman ako, in line to do that. Hindi, there's a transition. It's a, it's a process, so you have to start with embrace. things that you like. And you can't embrace all of it. It's a, it's a process, so actually we coach. Mm. You need to get coached. Pero doc, for example, mm. I want to be a vegetarian. Mm -hmm. Sana in the future. Uh, para maging <laughs> para maging healthy vegetarian, kailangan mm. you eat all kinds of vegetables. Yes. Hindi pwedeng selective lang. Hindi Say, pwedeng I eat potatoes lang, lang, lang or ganyan. Oh, it's also it's unhealthy pag ganun. Mm -hmm. Kasi sabihin ko 100% of my diet puro ganun naman. Yeah. It's a iba na mga naging junketarian, mm -hmm. vegetarian pero puro junk food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So, kailangan pag vegetarian ka, hindi ka junketarian. <laughs> o oh, sige, Doc, sa mga marami pang... So, dapat konti-konti. Tapos, uh, we go through, ano, meron naman mga mock, mock meat, eh, na parang meat, pero kasi parang pero parang natitinga-tinga ka. Oo, oh, oh, parang in the beginning. Kunwari, shrimp, yeah. kunwari. Yeah. But I, start, I started my kids, on, I actually rehabilitated the kitchen. Uh -oh. So, we started them on, ano muna, uh, seafood, kar... Uh, Seafood kare-kare, ganyan. Uh -huh. So, lahat ng mga luto na normal, merong substitute, lagyan mo muna ng seafood. Eventually, tapos may shapes yung mga chicken. Yeah. Tapos Ayan. eventually fish, tapos okay. hanggang wala nang mm, Marami pa kami gustong itanong sa iyo. At yes. saka, of course, yung televiewers natin gustong malaman yung iba pang detalye para maging uh, vegetarian <laughs> sila kung interested sila. Saan ka nila pwedeng makontak? Sa clinic na lang. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 uh. We have a Healing Well Integrative Medicine mm -hmm. Clinic. It's in Aurora Boulevard. Uh, we also have a Malate mm -hmm. and then Alabang. Mm -hmm. So, and Malate Biological Health. Telephone number po. Uh, there... Five to three. Ayan. 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 Yung sa Healing Well Integrative Medicine Clinic, it's in Aurora Boulevard. But you mm -hmm. can just call the 5231211. It's in Orosa. Malate, Manila, mm -hmm. um, to ask for, for details. Okay. Uh, the one in Biological Health Center uh, along Arosa, close to, close to Robinson's, Manila, mm -hmm. and close to St. Paul's. Mm -hmm. Easy to find. It's close oh. to my uh, alma mater, Sige. Healthy College of Kaka Medicine. Kakatokin ka namin dyan, Dr. Jessica De Leon. Maraming Pag salamat. Pag-a-sayot si Aurora ah. lang dyan. Oh, oh. Maraming <laughs> salamat. Okay. Luto-luto tayo next time. Yes. <laughs> Ito okay. mula sa clinic.